Your Excellency, our special guest of honor, one of the leaders of our party, the former governor of Plateau State, Senator David Jonah Jang, Your Excellency, the Deputy Governor, members of the National Assembly that are here, the chairman of our party, chairman of the elders council, the gubernatorial candidate of our party in Plateau State that has accompanied our leader for the flag of ceremony today, the chairman of the party in Plateau State, and my sister, Honorable Benela, who also accompanied our dear leader. Members of the State House of Assembly, the council chairman and your councillors, the chairman of the Rivers and Traditional Rulers Council, and other traditional rulers that are here, particularly the Nguele, Omagwa, and members of your Council of Chiefs. Gentlemen of the press, ladies and gentlemen, Your Excellency, let me, on behalf of the government and people of the state, most sincerely thank you for honoring our invitation. This is the second time you are coming to the state. The last time you came, you commissioned the civil servant quarters. Today, you are going to flag off the internal roads in Omagwa community in the Kuri local government area. Yes, I think we trust you to note that this was one of the communities when I started this struggle of becoming the governor from 2014, they gave me a lot of support through their son, Samuel Wanosike. Samuel Wanosike was one of those who risked their life when a lot of them were threatened in this local government. And so I told the people of Omagwa, having supported me, having played a crucial role in my election, I will also support you by providing this basic infrastructure. So I want to sincerely thank you for giving us your son, the chairman of council, for the support he has been giving to our administration and the support he has been mobilizing for our party in this local government area. I have no doubt in life that everybody must not like you. I have no doubt in life when you are doing well, people will hate you. But what is important is for you to continue to do well, let them hate you. Mm -hmm. Than not doing well, and then you are being liked. I prefer you to do well, let them not like you, but God likes you. And that is what is happening today in our society. So many people, I want to say there, and I don't give a damn what anybody says. I know those who stick their neck out when they stand for election in this local government. I know those. I know those who run to my house and tell me they have hijacked the materials. I know those who will tell me that, oh, the former governor came to my community and took all the results. So you want me to leave my own village? I come to your own village. But when we win, they become leaders. That has to stop. <laughs>